Sini mau mana? Wanna tell me just what the hell is so important? Sleeping mother. Sacred harbinger. Awaken and reclaim what is yours. You who rise with the moon in dark. Who prepares the path for the Midnight Sun? Turn your merciless eyes upon us, and arise! Nice show, Doc. Next time, call Zemo. Better yet, I'll just shoot you and save us all the trouble. I can feel it, Rox. Trouble in the air. More innocent blood joining you soon. <laughs> Head back to your magic castle. You ain't welcome here. It's called a sanctum. And welcome or not, this is where fate has determined the Sorcerer Supreme needs to be. Hell, fate answers no. This is the secret guardian you dragged me 5,000 miles to meet? Who's the mouth? Mr. Stark is brash, but I assure you, he can be trusted. Wait, you seriously don't know who I am? The fabric of magic is shifting, Johnny. The prophecy of the Midnight Sun is upon us. Your last crusade cost me plenty. This time, I intend to look after my own. Hey, pal, I don't think you understand. Things are changing. Two plus two no longer equals four. Up is sometimes down, and strange here is actually starting to make sense. Do I look like someone who gives a damn about any of that? No, you look like you should be bouncing for the double deuce. Listen, all I know is hell's coming, and my pal here says you can help. That's where you're wrong. Hell's not coming. It's already here. You're welcome, Robo Man. Um, Iron Man? It's okay. It's fine. I know what he meant. We come all the way out here, and the old man runs off with that precious page of yours. Uh, 
could have at least left us some VIP passes for the carnival. Maybe blown up a few monsters on the way out? Johnny Blaze has sacrificed a great deal for this world already. I am certain he will come around given time. Thought you said time was the one thing we didn't have. Uh, all right, let's just wrap this up. I think I've got sand in my nanopolymer weave. This should be good. That's the spirit. Getting it done any way we know how. And still reigning world heavyweight champion, Iron Man. Am I really gonna have to bring out the big guns for this? Interesting tactic. I'm afraid the odds still aren't in your favor. That suit may be a marvel of technology, but it's no match for the mystic arts. Allow me to demonstrate. Oh, so it's a contest now. Then you take the extra creepy one. Gladly. Let me show you the way. Fair enough. That was really something. It's in your best interest to quit now. Won't wear me down that easily, fiend. Got a round of warm bodies coming in. Perhaps there's a bounty on Sorcerer Supremes? Now that I have their attention, perhaps a blessing is in order. Something... protective? Well, I could give you a hand. Or a shield, in this case. In the spirit of cooperation, I'll accept your offer. Just this once. Ah, don't mention it. Looks like you could use this. I thank you. Let's try this. Lilith doesn't care about you. I hope you realize that in time. Let's give it a go.
by Lilith, and it may very well cost you your life. Sure, just keep throwing bodies at the problem. Everything according to plan. I think we pissed them off. Got a spell for that, maybe? Interesting. A spell to change the very demeanor of our enemies. Something along the lines of the psionic manipulations of Eros of Titan? If you can't make it happen in the next ten seconds, I'm not interested. I'm saving my energy so we need it. Not bad. Not great, but not bad. Watch closely. This is no trifling matter. Let's do it. And while you ponder arrows, maybe we should just try throwing a big rock at him? This shouldn't take long. If I'm being honest, that encounter went better than I expected. Tony, I've been noticing a recurring gamma spike. You see, this is why you shouldn't eat spicy food, Bruce. Localized in the West Village, converging on the Sanctum. One. The collective works of the universe's greatest sorcerers, and he left them underneath the takeout menus. <sighs> Shifting mystical polarities are wreaking havoc on my portals. You don't say. You okay, kid? Yes. Are you? Let's, uh, put a pin in that. Whoa. Carol. Bruce and I have been trying to reach you. He'd have come himself, but he's... Oh, you did the big green guy proud. <laughs> I really showed up my homeowner's insurance. Miss Maxima, the wards of protection, if you please. Stephen, I can fight. I've got control now. Then show me by activating the wards. In the meantime, in honor of our missing companion, the rest of you may feel free to smash away. Nice one, Carol. Always the direct approach. You know I don't mess around. Besides, we picked up some crazy gamma readings coming from, well, here. Guessing that explains the Hydra goons and ominous green lights. Yes, but not why you failed to use the front door. Um, hi, how about we discuss proper hero landing etiquette after we take down the bad guys? This won't end. So that's how that works. Here we go. I heard Lilith is kind of hot. Any of you dorks make a move yet?
signature move. By her command. I don't think they like me. They haven't given up yet. This shouldn't take too long. Oh, that Davenport was at least a century old. What a waste. my movement. tradition. They are surprisingly relentless. In any event, we must provide Wanda the time she needs to activate the wards of protection. Impressive. It's remarkable how well Hydra manages to attract new recruits despite decades of ineptitude. Love the effort. Let's do it. Does Hydra even pay you enough to cover your medical bills? waiting for we're three of the world's strongest heroes right doesn't it seem like this should be easier i've punched through scroll star cruisers that went down faster something's up yes hydra has clearly raised their game and i have a terrible suspicion as to how i know that wasn't your signature move Wards. Something's blocking them. Not something. Someone. 
Lilith, mother of demons, harbinger of the midnight sun. Prophecy or not, you overstep, challenging the sorcerer supreme. Be silent. Be still. Fellow daughter of Transia. You remind me of my own beloved. In virtue Devi Shanti! Well done, Miss Maximoff. Your unique energy surprised her. Whoa! I'm fine. What? I'm fine. The prophecy is in motion. Lilith is still out there growing stronger each second the midnight sun approaches. Define stronger. If we are to have any chance of stopping her, there is only one option left to us. I won't go back there. We all must eventually face our demons, Miss Maximoff. However, one of us should remain behind to maintain the wards of protection. I'll see you on the other side. Magic is unwinding. We are fortunate to be here at all. And where is here, exactly? Salem, Massachusetts. Well, a pocket dimension in Salem, Massachusetts. Oh, suburbs. Nice. Welcome to the Abbey. Home of the Midnight Sun. <laughs> the hell is this? Lilith's Junior Demon League? Wait, it's that jerk from TV. Which one? Now, if everyone would just take a moment... Enough! You're standing on my flowers. Oh, been a long time, Sarah. It's caretaker now. If I could have avoided this moment, I would, but... Oh, spare me the speech. I know Lilith's back. We're sisters, after all. <sighs> Guess we're suddenly invisible now. Shall we chat, Stephen? No one can argue that the Hunter earned their rest in the first battle against Lilith. I only hope they are up for the task once more. You wizards always make everything sound so lofty. I raised my sister's only child as a weapon against her. And saved the world in the process. Now you want me to dig them up and ask them to do it again. I did not write the prophecy, Sarah. Besides, I am no common grave robber. We are simply reuniting their ethereal essence with their corporal form. Speaking of, it would help to have a mental image for the procedure. Spare no detail. Spiritual identity theft is no laughing matter.
Child of light and darkness. You who tame the night. Hear the voice of those who beseech the end. The caller. Wait. Resurrection spells are concerned, I see worse, particularly on myself. Tony, come on, it's perfectly safe. That thing wakes up and takes a bite out of you. Don't blame me. The visiting hours are over. You can't stay here forever. There's nowhere else I should be. Just saw that Stark guy poking around behind the mirror table. Find me as soon as they awaken and play it. Be nice. Always am. The air burns with every breath. Has it been so long? I know this place. In my dreams, it was always empty. sense I am not alone have to admit hunter you make one hell of an entrance guess that makes two of us you should have struck when you had the chance vampire you will not live to regret your error cute and caretaker told me to be nice relax Slayer I'm a friend you just don't know it yet. Yes. I saw you with Sarah before. But what would she want with a vampire? Unless... The name's Blade, and I'm no ordinary vampire. I get you've been out of commission, but I thought you noticed since we're having this little showdown under the freaking sun. A dampier? Daywalkers were a myth even to me. Says the half-human, half-demon monster hunter. You appear quite versed in my history, Dampier. Heard my fair share of stories from Caretaker. The legendary hunter. Child of Lilith. Last champion of the blood. Some call you angel, some demon. Probably a little of both. Led the Knights of Wondagore against the armies of darkness until you fell at... Fell? Shoot. This is why they don't normally have me do the meet and greets. I can see why. Right. As much as I'd love to see how much weirder this conversation can go, we should probably get moving. Agreed. The prophecy is in motion. I can feel it. We have wasted too much time here already. Man, the others are really gonna love you. Others? 
Yeah, you've got a little fan club, I think. But why spoil the surprise? Hope you're up for the challenge, chosen one. I definitely helped, but no, that's the one thing I can't do. You were never able to raise the dead. Huh? But she just did. Maybe the hunter wasn't all dead. Some part of them had to be alive, otherwise my spell wouldn't have done anything. Which makes sense, I guess. Sounds like a reach to me. Huh, <laughs> coming from a vampire who loves to sunbathe at the pool. Half vampire. Half dead hunter. Either way, wouldn't count on that working again. Yes, we know. Just trying to help. How? By keeping an eye on things out here while the big wigs decide the fate of the world inside? Someone has to babysit the kitty table. Babysitting or not, you realize they still have you out here with the kitty, right? Oof, ouch. I'm giving you the benefit of the doubt, this time. Hunter? Not sure if you remember me, but we met briefly before. I'm the witch who called me back from the grave. Told you. Or Nico, but neither works. And this is... Robbie Reyes. <laughs> oh man, never thought I'd be standing next to you. Got quite a rep. I mean, caretakers told us. Stories. That's Ileana. Idiot. And I think you already met Blade. Of course. Caretaker has reformed the Midnight Suns. Well, how did you... Your power. I can feel it. I always do. So, welcome home. I guess we... I never left. Right. Well, we can fast forward through the tour then. The Abbey is still, well, you know, the Abbey. Basic stuff. Dorms, war room, library, a few places to chill, and, uh, whatever the hell the forge is. I have to say, for a haunted transient castle raised on the cursed grounds of Old Salem, it's pretty cozy. Of course, that doesn't stop us from adding some improvements. We can all thank Robbie for the Wi-Fi. 
Oh, and one more thing. We've got some new house guests now. You think we're a fun bunch, just wait until you meet them. Speaking of, we're here. Yeah, okay, spend 10 minutes in this place alone, Bruce, then see. Oh, <clears throat> gotta go. Show's about to begin. There isn't time for a refresher, much less that sort of training regime. You'll have to trust that the hunter's past experience is enough. So, crazy day, huh? Crazy. Caretaker's home for wayward sorcerers, scientists, and slayers. Eh, nah, sounds like something Doctor Strange would come up with. Lots of new blood around here. Uh, did someone give you a cup of coffee at least? I know I'm useless in the morning without a little boost. We could probably have one of these witches or warlocks magic you over a barista. It's almost impossible to imagine the horror, the atrocities committed on these grounds all those years ago. Then again, we are less than 20 miles from Fenway Park. Taking them. Unfortunately, time is of the essence. Otherwise, I'd gladly offer to walk you through some of the more pivotal events that have changed the world since you last saw it. Powerful, yes. But how powerful, we will see. With all these big names in here, maybe we should sell tickets. Ooh, could finally upgrade the TV to 4K. At least they don't have me stationed in some musty old dungeon like Strange and Stark. You act as if I'm thrilled with the situation. If you're concerned, then be all the more vigilant out there. Easy for you to say. Nothing about any of this is easy, Blade. Yeah? Tell that to Wanda. Big personalities, too. I think you mean big egos. But none of that matters unless they can help us get to Wanda. Prophecies be damned. It's good to see that face again. You look like it was yesterday. And you look... older. How long was I in that crypt, Sarah? No more than a few centuries. You were... missed. Centuries? And what of Lilith? Fallen by your hand. Until now. <clears throat> yeah, so speaking of Lilith... Tony? What? The kid's literally speaking of Lilith. Tony? That's my name. Tony, that's uh, Carol and Dr. Spooky over there. Here to help. Help with what, exactly? Oh, I don't know. Throwing the magic amulet into the volcano? <sighs> Smiting the dragon mother? You tell us, kid. You are the chosen one, after all. Do you recall anything of that last encounter, child? There was... a voice. The rest is hazy. Oh, a voice. That's it? A voice? That's what we have to go on? Results of your long crypt sleep, most likely. A minor inconvenience. Everything required to restore those memories is contained within my sanctum. I will simply alert Wanda to prepare the necessary rituals. What? Straight to voicemail? Some sorcerer supreme. Must be mystical interference caused by this little pocket dimension of yours. Perhaps Agatha can help. Allow me. A lot of. Whoa, what kind of network you run in there? The all seeing eye of Ereshkigal who judges, bound to enchanted Babylonian soul glass. We just call it the mirror table. Wanda! The dark force is pushing against the wards. Steven, where are you? That's impossible. Nothing on Earth could possibly affect those wards. 
Wanda's in trouble. Wanda is trouble. I'll go. You'll need my help, of course. Then let us make haste, Dr. Spooky. Our hunt begins now. They know of the Sorcerer Supreme, and I wasn't following you. How long have you two been sharing a room now? A day? Oh, I don't know. What do you say, though? Six, seven hours? Six hours, 43 minutes, eight seconds. And counting. Wow. And you're already bouncing off each other like an old married couple. Careful now. You're gonna make his cape jealous. It's a cloak, not a cape. And he definitely wouldn't be jealous of you. I'm calling it now. You two are going to be best friends before this thing is over. So that was Lilith, huh? It was a real 90s album cover vibe. 1690s, maybe. Hard to believe she's the hunter's mother. Resemblance dwindles when one is twisted by Cathan's power. Whose power? Cathan, the Elder God. Is Cathan the Elder God of metal bands? Oh, no. Tony, read your briefings. Relax, I'm just spinning him up. You think now's really the time for that? I nearly broke my hand on Lilith's face. She didn't even flinch. The more dangerous the foe, the funnier I get. That's debatable. With everything going on right now, we simply cannot afford to lose contact with the Sanctum or Wanda. Given the fluctuations in the astral spectrum, I should be seeing something. Unless Bruce is right about gamma interference. <laughs> if such a thing could even exist. But the wards have been activated before, and I've never experienced such a reaction. Or perhaps I have simply erased that timeline so as not to affect my own destiny. I am quite efficient with my future and past selves in that regard. Are you ready? The prophecy of the Midnight Sun does not linger, and neither should we. Lilith possesses the Darkhold. If she forced her way into my Sanctum Sanctorum once, I suspect she can do it again. You are a Sorcerer Supreme. Can you not predict her movements? Normally, yes. But since your mother breached the Sanctum, my sense of the future has grown voluminous in nature. Is that another language, or...? Ah, <sighs> fuzzy. My predictions are fuzzy. For the first time, as Sorcerer Supreme, I cannot foresee how the future unfolds, and with my apprentice in danger, we cannot tarry. Your sanctum will survive. We shall see to that. Indeed. The Sanctum Sanctorum has weathered its fair share of trouble over the years. Lay storms, a few short-tempered celestials, that issue with the Zoning Commission. But this time, it feels... different. I do not doubt Wanda's capability, but without my predictive acumen, I cannot bolster the wards should she need it. Still, the wards are woven into the Sanctum's very essence. They should hold. In any case, all will be revealed with time. I suggest we make use of it while it still functions. We should hurry. As much as I'd love to hear a first-hand account of your exploits, time is of the essence, I'm afraid. About time. Not just 
about time, Mr. Brooks. Time, space, reality, the building blocks of magic. All must be constant for my portals to work properly. Yet as we now know, that is no longer the case. We've heard. Several times. Otherwise, I would still be hunting dread maidens in my sleep. Indeed. And while I certainly appreciate the view of this vista, I fail to see how it will hasten our return to the Sanctum. Magic is the answer. No, as I've just stated, magic is the problem. Your magic is. Not ours. The ground you are standing on exists within two worlds. A mystical anchor point to Ileana's realm that allows her to... Well, I'll just let her show you. seen Portal before? You're standing in limbo. Nexus of all realities, both real or otherwise. A chaotic but secret realm beyond the influence of Lilith. Thus far. Are you certain of that? Because I am sensing all kinds of... Dark energy. That feeling you're being watched? General Hellho vibe? Yes. All these potentialities converging at once? A truly surprising feat, Miss Rasputin. For someone so young, of course. You think this is crazy? Wait until you see Manhattan. From here, magic can open gateways to just about anywhere on our planet, and beyond. We don't want to risk punching through the wards protecting your sanctum, Doctor. So we've chosen a safe exit a few blocks over instead. <laughs> Couldn't be worse than the last time. It was just a simple miscommunication. Ocean Avenue. I said Ocean Avenue, Magic. Well, at least we know the wards of protection are still in place. For now. I suggest we hurry. I hesitate to call this good news, but I'm seeing minimal Hydra resistance between you and the Sanctum. Looks can be deceiving, I'm afraid. There's no way these foot soldiers are behind the disruption of the wards of protection.
light shines on the most dutiful. Where do you think you're going? Interesting tactic. Follow by me. Just what this battle requires. For Hydra, no retreat. Payback's gonna be fun. I won't forget that. We haven't quite broken their spirit yet. That gamma spike we detected in your area seems to be growing. Let's assume that's not a good thing. Gamma or not, I feel the hand of my mother at work here. You got him.
give the mother my regards in hell. <laughs>